Good morning, folks. This is another beautiful day in rainy and cloudy Las Vegas. And yes, it is absolutely beautiful right now. This is Dan with Chef Dan Suka, and I've got number two of the Zumaret Blue Line Tobacco Review for you. This one is for Green Lemon. So you can see that there. It's got nice, refreshing images of limes and young lemons on there. And that's basically what happens to lemons. They start out as that nice bright green first and then they go to that yellow one and then they do their thing and limes are a completely different animal. So let's get started and not delay it too much. The stem on mom's my usual KM 1001 Night Spice which is on 80 foot 80 bowl, a mirror pre-punched foil medium duty and two charcoal flare coals or charcoal blades, charcoal blades excuse me, which do really really well by the way and water in the KM base. So let's and add the, uh, the usual um, carbon one AOT hose. So also please ignore the um, sound of the Air Force that gets started on their job pretty early in the morning. I like the new term that Matt Desson gave me and make sure you go check out his YouTube channel at Matt Desson. Lots of good reviews, great information, and also check out the AM Booker podcast. Usually they have a couple of shows a week. So go check that over there. And if you have a look here, this new thing is what I like what he called as a rough cut. I don't use inconsistent anymore because I think it puts a negative connotation on it that makes it seem like the product is bad when it's not. And as you can see, it's a blonde leaf, very golden color, no real artificial at all and no real artificial coloring that um, you can see. And as you see, it's just a simple rough cut, very similar to that of Alfacker, just not as big pieces, and that's pretty good. I like it. And put that off my hands. I know, ah, oh, shame, he wasted cheese. Yeah, yeah, I did, punish me later. Anyway, I can get that back in the pouch. It's kind of like putting a tent back in the back. Once it's out, it's hard to get it back in the correct way. Okay. The juiciness level is pretty even. It's not swimming, but it's just moist enough to really do the job. And the smell is what really got me first. I mean, the first thing I thought was really strong lemon heads. And sure enough, it smells just like really strong lemon heads, but also you get this natural scent of the skins in there, so that makes it even better. It's exactly that it's like lemon heads. It's nice and citrusy and sweet at the same time, so it's really good. Yeah, yeah I almost don't want to smoke the hookah. This smells so good. Yeah, that's good. So... This has been up here for a couple of minutes now, like five or six minutes. I took a few draws to get it going. But well, let's have a look at the clouds first. Not the biggest clouds, but I may not have enough heat on there, so let me move those out of the way. And I'll send you to a can. And let that sit there for a couple minutes while we talk about a couple other things. Uh, unless you've already heard about it, there's two legislations in California that are going on which will ban the sale of all flavored smoking products, meaning vapes, menthol cigarettes, cloves, and most importantly, Luca. That'd be SB39, uh, SB38, excuse me. And I believe the other one is AB739. If I got those numbers wrong, please, I appreciate the correction. So go and check those out and form your own opinions, but I strongly, strongly suggest that you say no to them whenever possible. That'll be the end of so much here that it's not even funny. It would also damage a lot of businesses and livelihoods, so put it on no. All right, now that we got that on there for a couple minutes, let's take a few more draws and see if we can get some better clouds. A little better. I 
standard berry yesterday, but I got a few. Clouds are, as you see here, they're fairly decent. I mean, they're not super giant thick, but they're pleasing. And you can make some good smoke rings with them. So I would say the clouds are pretty good. Hopefully you agree. And other than that, I'm not sure what else to say about the clouds, except that they do carry a nice candied lemon scent to it. They don't, it doesn't have the natural scent that I get in here, but it does have that lemon head scent to it in the clouds as you exhale. Most importantly, the flavor. Let's give that a try. I know it's a lemon, but to me it tastes like a fresh lime, and fresh limes are so good, especially when they're sweetened. I mean, I'll sometimes just take a lime or a lemon, cut it in quarters, dip it in sugar, and just enjoy that. And this is pretty much on that level. It's so good and sweet. It's not on the level of a margarita because there's other things in there, like the flavor of the alcohol and sometimes a little bit of mint. Actually, no, I'm wrong about that because that would be a mojito, but the flavor is pretty decent it's not strong but it's not weak and it's got the right level of sweetness so you're not as I usually say hurting your teeth or anything you can't taste any bit of the pith but there is a slight bitterness to it which lends itself to the sweetness and it just makes it even better so yeah this one's pretty good so go get yourself some it's available at five star Luca and Hookah Junkie and Zoomerette.com. They have a pretty good range of flavors, including their gold line, which is another blonde leaf line, and also they have a dark line. And I will be doing those soon enough. So, to recap, really good scent on the uh, flavor, uh, on the um, on the nose of it when you're taking a whip out of the package. It smells like a fresh lemon and a uh, lemon head both at the same time. The smell of it as the clouds come out it smells just like a fresh cut fruit, and the flavor and it has it doesn't have an exact fresh cut fruit um, flavor as it goes in, but it definitely has that uh, lemon head taste to it. So if you like lemon heads or lemon candies of any kind, you will definitely like this. So go get yourself some. This is for again for the. Um, Zoomerette Blue Line, the tobacco, the green lemon flavor. And again, I'm not really getting any buzz off of it, but I'm not really looking for buzz. If I get it, good. It's an extra piece of candy you get. It's more the enjoyment of the smoke, the flavor, the clouds, and everything. And this has definitely got it all. So go get yourself some. It is a, I used a um, H.P. Hooker John uh, funnel bowl. So I would recommend that, but if you have like a really small clay Egyptian bowl, that should work just as well too. If there's anything you didn't comment on or you have any questions, again, comment section below. Like, subscribe, and also again, say no to SB38 and AB739 if I got those numbers correct. Also again, do it every time. Luca Expo Worldwide here in Las Vegas, August 3rd and 4th. Don't come, you're going to be missing a grand old time. So I hope to see you there. I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great smoke. Go pack yourself a bowl and have a great day. Love you all.